MovieWeb.com. So, at the end of this movie, your character seems to be the only one who has never been affected in a positive way by Mr. Woodcock. Now, am I seeing that in the wrong way, or is he the reason you have the pizza job and the pool van? <laughs> right, you're saying, were it not for Mr. Woodcock, my character would actually be like a crackhead living in the street. Yeah. I, that's, you know, I never looked at it that way, but that's a valid point. That is a valid point. I guess, uh, you know, maybe Mr. Woodcock is responsible for the aspirations that my character has to have a pool business. That's what I was thinking. Well, we never see you working at the pool business. Because so. I don't. It's, it's still a dream. You know, it's not a reality yet. Oh, so you got the van, but you don't have the job. Yet. Right. You don't have any. Is there a lot of pools in Nebraska? I wouldn't even think there would be. <laughs> <laughs> Another valid point. I don't know. I don't know if they have a lot of pools in Nebraska. I'm sure it gets warm in the summer, but a lot of above ground pools. Now, where do you find the comedic courage to discuss Susan Sarandon's assets with such gusto? She's got good assets. So, <laughs> you know, while there was some vulgarities to it, I didn't do that around her. That would have been really awkward, but I'm sure she's a very confident woman and confident with her well-endowed assets. Well, I really like the theme of this movie that this guy takes something very negative in his life and makes something positive out of it, even though he doesn't see that until the very end. Now, have you ever had a negative experience or person kind of affect you in a way that you've created something very positive out of the experience? Not, nothing's jumping to mind, you know. I, I definitely didn't like P.E., but, you know, when I think about it, if if I had had somebody more more demanding or more uh, more of like a drill sergeant, maybe who had forced me to do it, then that could have been better. That could have improved my life somehow. But as it was, I think my guys were more apathetic. I mean, I didn't like any of them, but none of them were gonna actually force me to participate. How was working with that Craig Gillespie? I hear he takes comedy really seriously. Yeah. Now, I don't know if that's different than other things you've worked on, but what was that experience like for you? Well, I, I think, you know, I, I don't think you should take anything too seriously, but I think that comedy should come from a place of realness. So if you have a script that's innately funny because of the, the characters, the dialogue, and the situation, then you should play it real and it will be funny. Whereas I think comedies that I don't appreciate are when it's becoming cartoonish. So I, I, I liked it. I liked the, the, the approach to this. Well, how much input did he allow you to have as far as your look and your feel of the character? He, 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 it was all up to me. I mean, there were, there were takes where he wanted to get something different from me and we would get it, and then there were takes where I could do whatever I want. But, but you know, as far as the character, that was all up to me. Is it true your father-in-law is Joffrey Lewis or Jeffrey, Jeffrey Lewis? Jeffrey Lewis, yeah. People say it. Yeah. <laughs> so is he going to be on Earl anytime soon? He was on Earl. He was already? Yeah. Wait, yeah. It must he, have been the one episode on I missed. Season one. He played... Uh, oh, I don't remember that. He's a guy who we... What happened? We picked on his daughter and then because of that he didn't have a relationship with his daughter and so we kind of brought him and his daughter back together and he was like a drunk. And so we got him cleaned up. But yeah, it was season one. I don't remember really? the name of the episode. I watched yeah. the whole box set. I don't we've, had, we've had Jeff on the show and Julia. Yeah, I remember Julia on the yeah. show. Yeah, yeah. Cool.